So welcome to this video where we are going to talk about the tools to set up and speed up your outreach process. Outreaching takes a long time, it is very difficult and there is many ways to cut down the time it takes and this is everything is going to be about in this video. Now if you have been following Authority Hacker for a while you know that I talk a lot about Buzzstream, I really like it and this is what we use but I understand also that a lot of you don't necessarily want to pay another subscription and so in this video and in this entire blueprint we are going to only use free tools to run our guest posting process. If you want to see how we use Buzzstream I highly recommend you go through the skyscraper blueprint and you check also my review of Buzzstream that has a lot of tutorials on how to use it so I'm gonna link to that below but in this tutorial we're gonna get back to the good old Gmail and so if you have been following the previous video where we created the personas uh, and we have created a Gmail for them then you should be at a spot where you have a clean Gmail account, you have your Twitter profile, you have all these things ready but there is quite a bit of optimization that we can prepare before we get going. So let's just talk about the tools to install, everything's gonna be free or at least have a free version and let's get started. So the first one I highly highly recommend you install is called Yesware, you can see it's all over my Gmail here. It's basically a productivity tool for salespeople normally to email and so on but the truth is if people can use that to get money from people it's not very hard to use it to get links from people, it's actually easier. So one thing that it does is it actually tracks your email so you can see who is clicking and opening and that's pretty cool. You can track up to 100 emails per month for free, you can see I'm on a free plan here. Uh, this is not my average email anyway and I use Buzzstream but yeah you can definitely track quite a bit of email and that's pretty cool but there is more coming with Yesware. Another cool thing is like well when you edit an email like here you see about that you can track it or not track it so you don't waste your credit but you can create reminders as well. So when you outreach a lot of people will not reply to you maybe like 85 to 90 percent of people will not reply to you but if you send a second email that says hey did you get my email uh, last time then a lot of people will actually reply on the second try and so it's worth following up with a second email it's really powerful the problem is we all forget and trying to keep track of it if you don't have like a system like Buzzstream in a spreadsheet or something is a very difficult thing it's pretty messy uh, if you don't update it manually it's gonna take it's gonna not work and so on so it doesn't work really well but you can actually set reminders inside Yesware so you can actually click on a remind and say in one week and what this is gonna do is that this email is now going to jump back on top of your email in one week and so you'll be able to just follow back up with these people and that's really going to boost your outreach a lot with a free tool so that's pretty cool CRM forget it you don't need it the templates got templates you're gonna love it templates allow you to prepare now fill the blank templates so you can take the templates that I actually provide to you guys and you can see I have a link roundup submission one for example here which would say uh, and I don't use this email to outreach that's why it says zero it says hey name my name is Gail I, I blog about authority hacker I was looking at some link roundup uh, and I have a new post about this here's the links if you want to check it out thank you for consideration instead of copy pasting that I already have this inside my gmail and I just click templates grab that up say put a name I'm gonna put loss because we all love loss and the topic would be like link building and here would be my link and then I would click insert template and boom I can just send my email it's been all filled up it was very very easy to do right so let me just show you how you prepare a template so that you can actually import the templates we give you so click on new uh, when you click template and then you can just click new template uh, give it a name so a demo in that case maybe and an email subject hello and then maybe their name and you click on text field and you give a name to the field so hello name for example and this is going to be a fill the blank thing that I used earlier and then all you have to do is paste your template and then take the things in bracket that I have and replace it with a text field or drop down field if you want so you can create options it's even faster and then that's it you save it you'll be able to grab it in your template and you will outreach very fast without you know paying for any tool so that's pretty cool so that's basically it for Yesua, I highly highly recommend it for a free tool it's, it's amazing so check it out another tool that I highly recommend you check is if you check my sidebar here you see I have quite a bit of information this one is an invite for a call I actually have in one and a half hours from Mark but you can see that you know if I didn't know who Mark was you know it would be complicated but whenever you put an email address in your two box 
it's actually going to start grabbing all this information and this is called reportive and you can see the name, the email address, where they live, what they do, their picture and most importantly their Twitter and LinkedIn, uh, Facebook sometimes and what's cool is since you've created your persona uh, Twitter and you need to follow people and you need to show some engagement well you can click through and you can just click follow and then you're here so it's pretty easy to actually engage with people on social media, know who they are make sure you don't email the wrong person as well. So it's a pretty cool tool, it's called Reportive. You install it to Chrome and you will be able to see that on the side. So I highly suggest you install that. Now let's imagine that there is the opposite uh, situation. You have the Twitter profile of a person, but you don't necessarily have their email address. So for example, once again, let's take Lars because uh, we love Lars. So I'm gonna take Lars, come champion, okay, but how do I email him? And I'm sure if I go on content champion, there's only going to be a contact form. So how do I actually email Lars? Well, I'm going to recommend you install that find that lead extension on Google Chrome and you will be able to click here and to get the contact information from a person from social media. So you can do that from LinkedIn and you can do that from Twitter, I think. You can see there's only 10 searches per day, but I'm going to give you more tools in a how to find an email address lesson. Uh, to find these contacts, but that's really useful. So if you wanted to outreach to Lars, I just found him, uh, I found his site, I found his Twitter account, and I click here and boom, it's finding me the email address pretty easily. So uh, I highly recommend you install that, find that lead. It's gonna speed up finding the email address a lot for you guys. Now, here, let's take one more thing that we can speed up in your outreach process. And I, for that, I'm gonna go on Atari Hacker. And if you wanted to contact us, well, you could either tweet at us or if you're going to contact page, it's basically just a contact form. So you can't find our email and um, that's for a good reason. I want to have some control over who can email me and a lot of website owners are that way. But that means that, you know, all these mumbo jumbo of email templates that we talked about just doesn't work because, well, I don't know who to email it to. So to speed things up, what I recommend is that, well, you use the autofill from Chrome to actually fill that up. Uh, that's pretty easy, but then for the message, what I use is I use an extension that will allow me to create macros essentially. It's called Text Expander, so I do add GP, GPAH, for example, H1. So what I would do is I would go in my message, I would type at gpah1 and you can see that this little string of text that I know has been replaced by my outreach template and all I have to do is just go through these little bracket things and replace them with whatever I need to put to actually outreach to these people. So filling contact forms can be a lot faster if you use text expander. So I'm going to link to that at the bottom then the way you use it is you go in your extensions once, you, once you've installed it and you go in options. And here you land on that little screen that allows you to add shortcuts. Then you just choose you know, a string of text, in that case that was add gph1, and then here you can paste your templates. So you could have an unlimited amount of templates that you could be calling with just like six keys and not copy paste all the time. So that's a really good way to use contact forms when these websites are not allowing you to find their email, even if find that leads fails, which it will sometimes. So that's a pretty cool way to do that. So that's basically it for the stack. I highly recommend you install all these things. It's going to make the prospecting much faster and you will have a lot less pain in doing guest posting like a lot of people have out there. So I hope you enjoyed that video and I'll see you guys in the next one.